Hey guys, good morning. Welcome back to the video. I hope you guys are doing extremely well. So friends, in this video, I will discuss some most important MCQs of number system and logic gates. Okay. So let's proceed with the first question, which is what is the base of the binary number system? Option is 2, 8, 10 or 16. So the correct option is option number A, which is 2. Oh, second number question the sum of product sop expression represents a logic function using what option number a n gates followed by or gates option number b or gates followed by n gates option number c is xor gate and last option is not gates so the correct option is option number a which is n gates followed by or gates let's discuss third number question what is the primary advantage of using kmap in simplifying logic function? Option number A, it allows for faster computation. Option number B, it can handle complex arithmetic calculation. Option number C is, it can directly implement logic functions. And last option is, it is a hardware device. So the correct option is option number A, which is, it allows the faster computation. Next question, in a two variable K map, how many cells are there? Is it 2, 4, 8 or 16? Correct option is option number 4, uh, sorry option number B which is 4. Next question, gray code is, a uh, gray code is a binary code in which consecutive numbers differ by how many bits? Option number A, 1, option number B, 2, option number C is 3 and last option is 4. And the correct option is option number A, which is 1. Next question, how many bits are needed to represent 12 disti distinct values in a 3-bit binary code? Is it 1, 2, 3 or 4? Correct option is 3. Okay. Next question, which of the following is a code used for error detection and correction in data transmission? Option number A, BCD. Option number B, gray code. Option number C is axis 3 code. And last option is Hamming code. And the correct option of this question is option number D, which is Hamming code. Next question. In a two variable K map, what is the maximum number of adjacent cells that can be combined to simplify a Boolean expression? Option number A, 2. Option number B is 4. Option number C, 8 and last option is 16 and the correct option of this question is option number B which is 4. Next question and uh, this is the second last question. Which of the following is not a valid binary code decimal representation of the decimal number 9? Is it 1001, 1000 and 1100 or is it 0001? I am not going to explain any one of the question because I can understand neither you or nor me have time to explain all this question. So just by heart all these questions and go to our examination. Okay. And the correct option is option number C which is 1100. And the last question is the hexadecimal number 1A is equivalent to which decimal number? Is it 10, 26, 16 and, or 30? And the correct option of this question is 26. Okay. So, this was all the questions. Thank you so much for watching the videos. Please do subscribe the channel and hit the like button if you guys have enjoyed watching the videos. Thank you so much.